Hello, hello everybody. This is Josh from Painting by Josh. I'm just going to give you a bit of a rundown on a screen, a front fly screen that we're going to be painting here today. So I've taken it off. I've taken off the molding around the screen, taken off the actual fly screen. I'm going to give it all a good dust down, a good sand. I'm going to tape up around the hinges or the door handles and everything like that. Give it a, a mist of etch prime, the Dualux Metal Shield etch prime, and we'll be going over it with the Dualux Metal Shield multi purpose. This is a semi gloss finish, excellent durability, awesome adhesion, such a good product, and anything metal, it's perfect for. So, we're going to go through this is the old Brunswick Green or Caulfield Green. We're going to be changing it to the Colorbond Woodland Grey to match the, the front door that they've got there. So pretty pretty quick and easy process. Like I said, all you want to do is get the door off, take the fly screen off, tape up around any of the handles or anything like that, or the, the hinges, and give it a dust down. Give it a light sand, a spray mist of the etch primer the metal shield etch primer and then we go straight over it like I said with the metal shield so I'll show you some process as we get it, get it done and hope you will all find this uh, useful okay so here we are we've given the can a good shake a good mix up if you want to call it we have the metal shield etch primer this is an awesome anti-corrosive metal primer awesome for an etch prime exactly what it says so we just go through any corroded areas there's not much on here actually or just any any little screws or something like that you can give a bit of a mist coat but doesn't need, need too much like i said on this one she's pretty right to you know she's had a light sand i mean just go through and pretty much I'll apply our top coat. There's not much. We don't have to go etch priming the whole door or anything like that. The whole screen. It's in pretty good condition. There's not much rust or corrosion on it at all. Just a light pad. Just a light sanding pad. Uh, 180 grit. And we've got the job done anyway. But this is the, the etch primer. You can get this from Dulux, Bunnings. Any good paint retailer. Uh, and then this is our top coat, the Metal Shield multi-purpose. So we're going to get it done anyways, but I'll show you what's up when I'm spraying it out. Thank you. It's all taped up now. I've taped up all the handles. I've taped up the weather strip along the bottom here. Uh, we're good to go. Yeah. So what I'm doing now, I've gave it a dust down, like I said, a light sand with some uh, 180 pad. Gave it another dust down went through and sprayed out any corroded areas with the Dulux Metal Shield Etch Primer and now I've got the Dulux Industrial Metal Shield Multi-Purpose this is a semi-gloss finish perfect for uh, you know any any metal surfaces really so we're just going through like I said changing it from the old school Brunswick Green to the colour bomb woodland grey. Thanks. So we, you just you don't want to go loaded on. You're gonna to have to put a couple of coats because you're going obviously you've got different sides, so we'll flip it around and spray from the opposite way. Okay. And that way we're not gonna we're not gonna miss any there. Really easy to use, just make sure you give it a shake every minute or so. And then just keep getting it done anyway. Just then go back the other way and then flip it over and do the exact same thing. And as you can see the finish already is absolutely beautiful. that so really 
really nice getting it done as you can see beautiful finish well that's pretty much the process obviously you'll wait for one side to dry or you can do it standing up and put a bit of cover up on the wall and stand it up and spray it like that whatever is easier for you uh, that's pretty much it so here we are now we're just going through applying we've already finished the other side two coats looks like a factory finished powder coated door it's going to last just as long i'm just applying first coat on the other side like i said you've got the weather strip taped off got the door handles taped and we're just going through now and applying our first of two top coats this pretty much use just over one can per side so if you get three cans it's pretty much all you're going to need one coat of the metal shield primer and three top coats you know so you can potentially do your door depending on what product you want to use i do recommend the dulux metal shield range for this type of thing but you know for forty dollars uh, you know you can potentially make your screen door looking brand new or if it's bare aluminium exactly the same process so here we are we're just going as you can see always make sure you give it a good shake said so this was the Brunswick green there and you can just uh, just put on the color bomb woodland gray but how easy it is and it should only take yeah. five ten minutes aside really Just make sure you double check everything make sure you got no misses on it before you start putting on all your your fly screen molding and everything like that but yeah that is absolutely beautiful so that's first coat just can't wait for it to dry do it again and then we're ready to go all right so here we go we're just applying the second of two top coats on now making sure it's all sweet but look at it even in the sun there you can see how nice it's coming up it's coming up like a brand new factory door just gonna go through double check for any misses apply my second coat uh, and then we'll be ready to demask it leave it 10 minutes and we'll go through and de take off all the eye clip info tape and then it's right to hang in a couple of hours that's pretty much it anyway hope you all uh, found this useful I'm sure, you know, there could be some screen doors you would like to get painted now. So here we have it. Simple, effective, fast, cheap way to change your screen doors.